Hey, what's up guys? Ian from iHelpCorner.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to jailbreak version 5.1.1. This is an untethered jailbreak. It works on all iDevices. That means the iPhone 3GS, iPhone 4, 4S, iPad 1, 2, and 3. Uh, not really the iPad 3, it's called the new iPad, but you guys know what I mean. And uh, pretty much every single iDevice. You're going to need to download Absinthe. Uh, 2.0 or 2.0.1 it doesn't really matter I know that the servers are a little packed right now since it was just released today so I uploaded it, uploaded them to my website also so you can download it from there alright so once you have absent downloaded just left click on it twice to open it and then if you're on a Mac it'll make you open it again it just does that if not Windows it'll just open up like that Alright, so once you have your 5.1.1 iPhone or iPod or iPad plugged in, it'll say, you know, it's been detected and click the button to begin. All you do is you click jailbreak. It's going to send the jailbreak data. Here, I'll just leave my iPhone right here so you can see. It'll say restore in progress. It's not restoring. Don't worry about that. It just does that. I'll be back once the jailbreak is almost done. It doesn't take too long, but you know, it just depends. It was released today, so the servers might be packed. Uh, so it might take a little longer than normal, but it shouldn't take more than like five minutes. Okay, it's going to pretend to reboot, and then you're going to see it right now. It's respringing, now pretending to restore. I know you guys have seen this before. It's not really restoring, don't worry. It's really similar to that first absent jailbreak. Uh, I remember I did a similar process. It doesn't really restore your phone, don't worry. Alright, it's uh, ready to go. And once this tells us it's complete, we can disconnect. Don't disconnect yet, though. And it didn't freeze because the bar is still going. Just give it a minute. Don't want to mess with your iPhone. If you do it early, you could mess up the jailbreak. And uh, save yourself the trouble because once you jailbreak, I'm sure many guys know, backing up is a little bit harder. So, you know, save yourself the trouble. Alright, the jailbreak is done. It says done. Enjoy right here. So once it says that, you can just disconnect your iPhone. You know, slide to unlock and go to Cydia. Open it up and it's ready to go. Just let this finish and you can install whatever you want. The jailbreak is untethered, so I hope you guys liked watching this video. Please comment, rate, subscribe. If you guys did have the 5.1.1 tethered jailbreak, what you guys need to do is search for, it's called Rocky Raccoon. R-O-C-K-Y and then uh, in space and then it's raccoon but it's spelled wrong it's R-A-C-O-O-N not R-A-C-C -C. it just has one C uh, search for that and you'll see like a 5.1.1 untethered thing uh, install it and you should be good to go anyways I hope you guys liked watching this video please comment rate subscribe if you have any suggestions for future videos feel free to message me in the comment section or uh, you know, I need a private message. It doesn't matter. Uh, follow me on Twitter and Facebook for updates, status updates, and more. I'll keep you guys up to date on tech news and everything you guys want to know about tech. And finally, if you guys have a YouTube channel and you guys want to be partnered, uh, send me a private message and we can talk about that. I can get you partnered. Just let me know. Thank you.